So I hope you can see us now because I've changed, changed it now. It still says waiting for Timothy Dowd. There is no live chat. Testing with external mic. It's still not coming through. Which is a shame. Oh, here we go. Yeah, we're on now. So what I forgot to do with the original was to put the auto start stream. Otherwise, you've got to go and manually start it. So that's pretty cool that it's working. Um, I think I've turned live chat off, though. I might have turned live chat off. So this is with the microphone. So this is this microphone. I hope it's okay. It's at plus six gain. And uh, this is a members-only stream because it's a test. And I just thought I'd do it. So I don't think you can actually chat because I've not turned it on. Let's see if I can go and turn that on then whilst I'm doing it. No, I can't. Bear with me, ladles and jelly spoons. So I've got a, I'm going to content, live, open this one up. Edit it, go into this. I know it says live chat should be available to anyone. And I'm going to put this down now. Open this one up. There we go. So, edit it. Go into. Afcast is there. It says live chat should be available to anyone. It's not too bad actually. There we go. So this is what the thing looks like. So I'm going to turn this down. Okay, so that's the uh, thing. I'm going to go out to the wind now to see what the wind uh, muffs like. So I shouldn't really need my. Uh, my phone. Let's see if I can do a. This is a pan mode, so I'm going to go to follow mode. Oh, it's in follow mode. Okay, so I can I can point you down. So this is the uh, the little tomato plant that I saved. It was growing there in the corner, right in the corner there, and I pulled it out and potted it, and it worked. Pretty cool. So this is what my balcony now looks like. I've tidied it up. Cool dude. We can walk all the way around. Just got to get rid of these chairs now. And that'll be it. So I'm quite happy with this, actually. Just to see my chat, I can't see the chat. Members only. No thumbs up. Nobody watching. Okay, maybe they didn't get a message. But that's okay. I wonder if I can change it on the fly to public. Let's see if I can change it on the fly to public. Uh, don't look at the mess. We got some loads of boxes here. I've been doing some unboxings. Christina's in the bedroom. Spare room's going to be tidied up today. Well, no, because we're going out for lunch today. So I'm not going to sit in the sun. I'm going to sit in the shade now. There we go. Turn you around. Cool dude. So face tracking's enabled. So I'm going to see if I can turn it public now. Uh, copyright, no. Edit. Members only. Can I go public? Public. Done save well it's done it so it might look like uh, I've gone public now so if you're just joining us this is Tim Dow for Living with MS in Tenerife 
and I've just gone public with this uh, with this thing and hopefully you can do you can look at the live chat now if not there's a problem I'm just gonna to listen to myself and I've just gone public with this uh, with this thing and but I don't like the jerky I don't like the jerky stuff you know I mean I think the videos jerky the sounds on the internal on the external mic is a little bit crackly but uh, I don't know why Let's see if I can change that. I can now go to here and take the transmitter down to zero. So now we're at the zero dB, which is basically the, the, the ceiling, if you like. Let's see if I can change that. So I'm just going to listen to this. I can now go to here and take the transmitter down to zero. I'm just so listening. Now we're at the zero dB. There's is the zero dB. No, there's still a little crackly in the background. So I'm just going to listen to this. Okay, so I'm going to turn this external mic off now. So external mic's going off. Okay, so this transmitter one is disconnected. Now you should be on the um, on the internal microphone. And let's do channel mono. Noise reduction is on and the direction is all uh, wind noise reduction is on and channel is mono let's go to channel stereo see what happens see if we can change that halfway through the stream so now you should be listening to all the um so if i go to the other side now this is the left uh microphone this is the right microphone and this is the front microphone so uh, we'll have a look at that as well um, I don't get any live chat because it says it's still members only so it probably didn't change although I did change it while it was running but what I'll do is I'll finish it and uh, and see what happens well there's a thumbs up so somebody's on I'm going to actually finish this finish me looking at it, I'm not going to finish this I finished me looking at it and then I'll get the link again and now I'm watching an advert so that's a good that's a good sign that it's public let's get oh yeah there are people on cool dude okay the crackle sound should be finished now so sounds perfect now so okay great so uh, basically when you're live you can't use the external mic I've got a, a um, a thing in with with DJI that's doing it but uh, let me show you can I show you yeah I'll take a picture of it so let me take a picture of the setup I'll put it here like this and uh, I'll take a picture of the setup and show you so I'll just take a, a normal photo I'll take a picture like that and I'll turn it around this way I'll take a picture like that okay so let's see if I can show you this now let's get you out of the Sun um, so the first picture is the way I'm looking at it here so let me just do that and let me turn face tracking off and put this on so this should now show you the setup I've got it so it's on a pole the pole didn't come with it this is the extra battery and the normal thing but the poles mine I got it with Feutech, in fact, the little Feutech. And this thing on the end here is um, is my Wi-Fi. So let me show you the next picture. I'll show you the Wi-Fi better. So basically, it's just a little square box with a SIM card in it, and I connect to the SIM card. So that's pretty good. Plenty of battery. I'm going to go back to the live stream now to see your comments. If you're still on. Yes, you are. So I started it off as a members only, but it didn't look like anybody was on. Uh, Anne Marie came on and said, "Sounds not great." Can I turn? Can I turn on the uh, uh, chat filter, community moderation, chat filter all messages? That's better. Okay, cool. And last cuts. Community moderation. 
Live chat is on. Anybody? Message delay none. Block words no. Community defaults no. Okay. Chat publicly is turned. Paul's on. Afternoon. Like I say, picks fine. External mic breaking up. Perfect now. There you go. I think the problem with the external mic in lives is known about. I think they're hoping for a software update. We just got a software update and that's what I'm testing. Um, but um, it's obviously hasn't fixed that problem. It was a software update for the mic. And uh, they asked me to do it. And this, I'm going to send them this link so they can see it's not fixed. But it does sound good. I mean, basically, it's got wind reduction on it. I mean, there's not much wind today. But if I go around the corner, there's a little bit of wind. Can you can you make any? No, there's not enough wind to make difference really. But I'm using all the um, all the microphones, so I'm just going to go to face detection. There you go. So now I can basically just vlog myself without even looking at the camera, which I think is pretty cool. <laughs> so it's a nice, quite a nice little setup. I put on a wider tripod as well because it's got a more weight to carry. And it's a little bit higher than the normal one. But there you go. I've also uh, connected it to the... So it's going to zoom. So I can zoom into 1.6. So I'm quite far away now. So does it sound tinny? I don't... Let me just listen to it myself. Oh, I'm not even playing it. Actually, it's very good, you know. It is very good. Oh, I turned it off by accident. <laughs> uh, how do I get you back? History, there you go. I've got to watch my advert again. Money, money, money. <laughs> so, uh, Michael, you got one of these. So it's really good. It, you, you don't need your phone. Once you've connected the live stream, you don't need uh, the phone. Oh wow. Uh, how do I get you back? History, oh wow. Thank you so much, Ian. Ian, if you're watching, thank you so much. I shall uh, tell Christina Lee. Does it work with other wireless mics? No, it doesn't connect wirelessly, but if you do have a wireless set, which I've got, uh, you can theoretically plug that in to the USB-C socket but I think you, it, it's not a use it's not an interface so you have to plug USB-C to um, mini jack uh, connector and then plug it in using the mini jack so it's, it's a lot of different wires and stuff so and you probably wouldn't get any better uh, in this scenario than just going to the camera you know what I mean I mean this the, it is surprisingly good. These surround uh, microphones with wind protection, they sound really good. I'm quite happy with it. Reasonable amount of bass in the sound, okay. Uh, external mic, maybe Bluetooth reset. You know, I've done that. Uh, they told me to do a Bluetooth reset. They told me to do a um, an upgrade of the of the firmware the only thing was i upgraded the firmware without checking what the old version was so i'm not even sure because i only got this a couple of weeks ago or last week in fact so i'm still not sure whether it was uh yeah there we go picture quality and sound are oh, great roata thank you very much would this work for a gji pocket 2 i'm not sure whether the pocket 2 has live features i'm sure it must i'm sure it must but uh, I've never, this is my first DJI pocket. I always use the Feutech. I use Feutech gimbals for um, GoPros. That was the original. If you go back and look at some of the old videos that I did on the Maritime Walkway, those are always all done with the GoPro uh, Hero 6 and a Feutech gimbal, which my son-in-law's got now. And uh, basically, it's, uh, this is my first DJI and I'm really pleased with it. So if you're watching DJI, don't forget to send me the latest stuff to review. <laughs> oh, I'm terrible. Let me turn face tracking on. There we go, we have face tracking on there. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so I like this setup because it's uh, it's one thing. Once you've set 
the live stream what you have to do you have to turn your camera on then you have to turn your wi-fi on or your hotspot on your phone very important wi-fi or hotspot first then you go into the memo app then you connect to your phone and what what it does it disconnects from your wi-fi and goes to the phone wi-fi then you tell the phone which wi-fi to use and if you don't see the wi-fi in the list because you're using your um your hotspot you go to manual connection you put in the name of your hotspot and the password and then it'll connect once it's connected to that you say go live and as soon as you get the go live message on your phone on the memo app you can actually turn your phone off i just did that earlier to test it because the now the camera is streaming directly through your uh we can't phone, turn the phone off if you if you're using the uh the um hotspot but i'm using a little mi-fi so it's just a sim card in a tp link mi-fi works quite well i pay 10 euros a month for 25 gig so actually i can go live on this and not use the phone which i think is what i'm going to do the only thing is you have to set the live stream up uh, not using the studio app but you have to use the website and when you use the website you have to create a, a streaming key copy that and put it into the live stream here once you've done it once it remembers it and it also remembers it on YouTube so then what you do is when you're creating the new live stream you can either just copy the old one and change the name or you can go in create one from scratch and then pick the streaming key. Once you pick the streaming key, you have to remember to turn on auto start and auto stop. Because if you don't do that, it'll wait for you. Once you do go live, it'll wait for you to um, to go back to the computer and turn start and stop stream. So it's very important. So turn your MiFi or um, hotspot on first. Then you set up your live stream in YouTube studio in the browser very important create a new one uh, streaming use streaming software not mobile streaming software and uh, do all the bits um, public you know private whatever you want to do and then press create after you've created it you go in and pick the streaming key that you set up that you've already copied into your pocket three uh, actually the first time you do it you've got to set it up first and then do that so it's a bit weird actually anyway you'll you'll work it out once you do your live streaming on Mimo it's got a place for you to put all the details in and um, I'll use RTMP not YouTube because YouTube try, tries to create a new one and when you create the new one it doesn't allow you to do auto start for some reason I think that might be a, uh, a YouTube problem Theoretically, you could create it. I might try that later on the next one. You might be able to create the uh, YouTube live stream using the YouTube interface in the Pocket 3, in the Mimo app. But then you're going to have to go in and edit it to turn on automatic start-stop before you start streaming. That's very important. Because once you're streaming, you can't change anything. Right. Let's see what you guys are saying. A uh, slight breakup in the audio now, oh dear. A very slight. Morning again, Tim. Richard Howells. Retracted. Morning, Tim. Techno, Tim. Morning, Tim. Sorry if I missed the reason, but no walk morning. Uh, we actually, I actually did the walk. This is a, a, a secondary live stream that I was live streaming to members only. And uh, nobody came on because they obviously didn't, didn't ping you guys, uh, your members. Because um, I just wanted to do a test. And then I set it to public, and then it worked. So that's pretty cool. So there was a walk this morning. If you want to go watch that and catch, and catch up, we I met Ian, Ian um, Miller, from Balcony Banter and Food for Thought fame. I met Tenerife Tez, who's uh, he's done. He's only been on the island for a few days, and he's done forty videos up to now. So you'll be you'll be Tenerife Tezing out for the next. Have oh, a frozen. Looks like a frozen there, girls. Oh no, it was just me. No, it was me. It was me. Um, 
Yeah, Tenerife Test was on, and then uh, a very old friend of mine and, a, and her husband uh, have arrived on the island day before yesterday, I think. And uh, so we went for a walk with them. They're going to come and see us on Monday, but we're going to go and say hello at the weekend to them as well. Uh, today I'm going for lunch with Lee the McMaster, and he's going to vlog that, so watch out for that. And he'll probably release the breakfast vlog we did yesterday sometime today, hopefully. And you can have a look at that. Wow, so much technical to absorb. Thanks, Tim. Yeah, basically, it's uh, it's sort of... It, it, it takes you through it anyway. So if you press the live stream, it says, what do you want to live stream to? Facebook, YouTube, or RTMP, which means you can you can copy and paste the link that you want. That you want. And, um, and then go live and then start and stop and all that, what I said before. What I'll do is I'll write it down in chronological order of what I do it. And then I'll do a special one to do that. Nick Pace has just sent me, uh, just sent me a message. Hi, Nick, if you're watching. Uh, da, 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 James Kerr saying good morning. Are you enjoying the piece from Webby? <laughs> uh, Webby's uh, contacted me today. He sent me the pictures of his beautiful little granddaughter. Big shout out to uh, what she called. Rose is the second name, Demi, as in Demi Moore. Demi Rose, there you go. Not Demi Srusos, Demi Rose. John Beavis, still getting some crackly, no dear. Did my did me microphone turn back on? No, it didn't. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna turn my microphone back on just for the test. Okay. Uh, audio input, use for audio input, 100% battery remaining. And it is recommended to use 5.8 gigahertz to ensure streaming quality. Okay, we did that. Uh, it is on 5.8 gigahertz, but I'll just check. Microphone, transmitter one, gain zero. Mute off, pro, pro. Okay, I can't change it. I can't change anything, I don't think. I can't go into settings while it's run. Okay, anyway. So apart from that, you should be getting more crackling now with the internal mic, but it should be a bit louder unless um, you probably won't be able to hear the, the hoover over there. So let me just show you where I am. I'm on the balcony, as you know, from Balcony Banter. It's following my face perfectly, which I, this is what I really like, actually, because we can just put stuff behind me. and I don't even have to worry about framing or anything. I really like this. In fact, if you do want to frame, what you can do is frame yourself in one corner and then it'll just keep you in that corner. It doesn't matter where the where the thing goes, it'll eventually keep you in that corner. So you can actually talk about stuff behind you. You've got to remember to stop looking at yourself, though. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thanks for bearing with me. Thanks for uh, being on the technical side. I know a lot of people don't like this stuff, so that's not, not a problem. There is an off button. Okay, so that's worse, Tim, yeah. I expected it to be worse, so that's okay. Um, so I'm going to turn this back off again. transmitter is now off we're back on the internal microphone and uh, okay we'll see you on the next one so this is Tim Dowd for living with MS in Tenerife signing off now I think I cut off early on catch up if I press the button straight away so I'm going to count down from 20 so 20 19 18 17 16 15 14 13 12 11 10 9 Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, press.